In this video, we're going to show you the key steps to obtaining a successful bladder scan when using the BBS Revolution and address some common questions when using the BBS Revolution. We'll also show you some tips and suggestions. So let's get started. Here's a quick review of the three key steps when using the BBS Revolution. Use the entire packet of ultrasound gel approximately two to three fingers below the umbilicus. So these gel packs are a great complement to our device because they're the perfect amount of gel um, that you would need to use for a good scan. So you remove the scanner from the console and you need to wait for the Bluetooth connection. That blue blinking light will turn solid. And you place it directly in the gel. You apply firm pressure in ensuring that that gel is coating the entire white window of the scanner. But do not move the scanner while you're scanning. You want to keep it vertical to the patient. The outline of the graphical bladder image on the right will turn green to confirm a successful capture of the bladder. After disinfecting the scanner, immediately dock it back into the console as it will air dry. When you're first learning to use the BBS Revolution, we suggest you do multiple scans on your patient. And with each scan, add just a little bit more pressure. And remember, you only have to hold that pressure for one to two seconds on your patient. But before you know it, you're gonna learn exactly how much pressure you need in order to get a good scan. Here's an example of not using enough pressure. And here's an example of using the proper amount of pressure. You only need to apply that proper amount of pressure for approximately two seconds. 